I started acting when I was like six, so I wasn't really a theater fan first, but um, I started in a local singing, acting, and dancing class, and um, they arranged for us to go into a manager, um, and I did a Welch's Grape Juice commercial. <laughs> I read a Welch's Grape Juice for commercial for them, and I got signed. Didn't really know what that meant, but I, um, yeah, I got signed and they started sending me out on stuff and that's how it started. One of my first auditions, which was for Night of the Hunter, and um, I got that uh, after a long audition process. And I got that <laughs> and um, one of our like last shows, uh, the casting director for Les Mis was very close friends with someone in the cast of Night of the Hunter. and. She wanted me to go out for it, and I did, and I got it, and that was a great start. The audition came pretty quickly, but as soon as I, you know, was being considered, I took it out from my school library, and it wasn't, it was just like a children's, one of the versions, one of the many versions, and I read it. It was it's completely different, <laughs> like completely different, because this is a very different telling of it, and it's, but yeah, I did, and it was, interesting, but it was more like the classic than this. Favorite part is my, I love having a character like Chloe who's goes from have being in tough times with her parents, you know, having the divorce and then seeing the transition between that and her going into this fantasy, amazing world, Wonderland. And um, I love Welcome to Wonderland and I love when we're dancing and it's just really fun all around. I don't know, it's when I'm seeing all the men in, uh, in their Wonderland dresses, I guess that's kind of what does it. And um, yeah, it's just really fun because I'm always running. And I'm running everywhere. So yeah, I, I think it's, a, it's crazy for Chloe and I think that that's, that that's what she would be doing. She would be kind of, you know, uh, surprised by everything that she's seeing but just enjoying it. It's really hard because I'll go from studying and then they'll call me and say we have to go rehearse and it's completely different worlds but um, I I managed to get it done somehow I don't know how but I do <laughs> it's never a steady amount of hours that I get like ever um, but I try to get it as much as I can and um, some days I'll get four hours some days I'll get like less than one the electric company um, I I am uh, Gilda Flip in the electric company, the newest season, coming out in February. And um, I play one of the pranksters, a prankster in training, actually. So um, Gilda, she is, uh, Francine is her role model. And Francine is the, the lead prankster, but kind of like Wonderland, I am smarter <laughs> than her, and but I don't realize it. So I just do everything that she does. Like there's mustaches that we wear to, you know, uh, as disguises, it's 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 a really fun part, and it's it was crazy experience. A as a career acting, I know that now I'd love to keep doing it. I know I I'm seeing all the adults. It's very it's a struggle to, and they were talking about that. They're talking about that all the time. How th this is what they love, and and you know it's hard at times, but this is what I love, and I think I will keep with it. People all over America should come see Wonderland because it's a show that is really fun and it brings out the child within.